is up YouTube prepared wanderer in the office tonight and um, I'm looking at a website that I wanted to talk about tonight this is uh, the primal gear unlimited website and this is going to be a very different video for me it's gonna be very unusual because this video is gonna be a rant and um, I feel like I owe it to people who watch YouTube to really post this video um, I think it's necessary and hopefully it helps somebody because um, I wish someone posted it for me because it would have helped me in the long run so stick around for this one because it's gonna get hot so why are we talking about primal gear unlimited well let's go back a ways and start with Maybe five years ago, there was a, a kind of an influx of videos on YouTube from different YouTubers about survival, compact survival bows. And Primal Gear Unlimited was one of those bows that got tested a lot. There's a lot of videos on YouTube for um, Primal Gear Unlimited bows. And... Um, it you know it was very very popular and tested very well with the people who were doing videos on them and doing um, reviews. Now, if you're not familiar with Primal Gear Unlimited, the bow they the type of bow that they make is a survive what they call a survival bow, and it is a modern long bow that folds into a compact package, and that allows you to put it in a backpack and take it with you. And then when you get to your destination, open it up, string it, and now you have a fully capable modern longbow to take out in the field. And there's, there's other companies who do this as well. Primal Gear Unlimited is not the only one. They state that they are the originator and the original folding survival bow. Um, I don't know if that's true or not. But uh, there's definitely plenty of competition out there. There's the SAS Survival Bow. Uh, there's a few others that I'm not familiar with, but there's a bunch out there. So, um, you know, a lot of different YouTubers were reviewing these bows back then and posting videos, and they became quite popular. And, I, and, and like many people who, who is a fan of YouTube, like myself, became kind of fascinated with these bows um, I always wanted to try one, and I've been thinking about it and thinking about it. I thought, you know what, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to pull the trigger and purchase myself one of these bows and purchase all the accessories that go with it, the arrows, everything that I need, and try this thing out and see what it's like. I thought, man, this is going to be a lot of fun to have one of these. And I did my research and watched a lot of videos and read reviews online, and Primal Gear seemed like it was really um, a dependable bow to purchase and uh, so I made the purchase well come to find out that um, once I made that purchase that uh, communication with the company dropped off considerably and they would not answer any of my emails I sent an email wanting to um, uh, stop uh, a couple of the items that I had purchased I, I wanted to you know fix my order and I was getting no response I even called the number that's on their website <clears throat> and no one answered and actually it said that the their voicemail box was full I thought that was weird really strange that they wouldn't respond that they wouldn't take my call it just was unusual because when I placed my order for my bow and all my accessories, I immediately got an email back saying your order has been placed. It will be fulfilled in a few days. Um, you know, thank you for your order. An automated email system, obviously, but still it was very, um, very quick. And I thought, okay, great. I'm going to get my stuff. And then, well, a week later, nothing shows up. Um, you now it's a couple weeks now. They're not responding to my email or my calls. I haven't received anything. So I start doing research and I come to find out that Primal Gear Unlimited's website is fully up and functional and taking orders, but they are not fulfilling any orders. They're not answering any emails. They're not answering any phone calls from customers and they're not shipping any products. 
And uh, there, if you go on their Facebook page, there are tons of people posting rants and raves about what the heck is going on. Where's my stuff that I paid for months ago? I still haven't received it. You won't answer my emails. So luckily I paid my bill through PayPal. So I'm disputing my PayPal payment with, with through PayPal. I'm going through their protection program. And uh, hopefully soon they will reverse the order and give me my money back. But um, it's just, it's, it's freaking ridiculous that a company that has this much <clears throat> um, exposure in the bushcraft community is still up and running their website and taking people's money but not shipping the products and not communicating why they're not shipping the products. I mean, it'd be one thing if, they're, if the bow was back ordered and that they needed a few weeks to complete the order because it's, it's being manufactured, but then you need to send me an email and tell me that. You can't just sit there and ignore me um, because now I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to escalate the, you know, escalate this thing to a higher level and hopefully get it taken care of. But it's just, it's, it's infuriating. It's maddening. Um, it's upsetting. And uh, it took me a little bit of digging to find out that this was going on with Primal Gear Unlimited. So this is my warning video to you guys. If you're thinking about buying one of these survival bows, do your research. Don't go to Primal Gear Unlimited. Do not purchase a bow from them. Now, <clears throat> that being said, I have a Primal Gear Unlimited bow. Where'd I get this at? Well, I purchased this secondhand on the internet on a forum that I belong to. I was talking to some other people about Primal Gear Unlimited and about this bow. And someone contacted me and said, yeah, I've got one. I'll sell it to you at a decent price. And I said, sure, I'll take it because I'm not going to get it through the company. I'm going to have to buy this thing secondhand, which I'm glad I did because I got, a, I got it on a really decent price. And the guy who sold it to me is a really good guy. So it worked out for the both of us. But I still have my money tied up with Primal Gear Unlimited for a new bow and for arrows and for accessories. And it doesn't look like I'm ever going to get them. Um, which sucks big time because I am not a rich man. Uh, the money that I spend, I save <clears throat> to buy gear so I can do reviews uh, for my channel and because it's fun and because I enjoy it. But it's not like I have tons of money to waste on on stuff. And I certainly don't have you know that much cash just to plunk down and let it set and not, nothing happen to it. I can't just forget about it. Um, it, you know, it, it's a decent amount of cash for me personally, and uh, I, I want my money back, Primal Gear Unlimited. You guys suck. And um, I'm just I'm putting this video out to warn everybody, do not go to their website. Do not make a purchase. It is not worth it. There are other ways and other bows to get. So <clears throat> believe me when I tell you this is a, this is a warning. So. And uh, I think it's going to be a fun bow to shoot and play with. Um, like I said, if you're not familiar with these survival bows, it, they're, they're a folding bow. So these limbs actually fold into the handle. And then the whole bow is only this long, which is really cool. So more videos coming with my new survival bow. Survival. Put that in quotations because I don't know what that means. <laughs> You know, uh, companies use the word survival to sell stuff, obviously, and uh, it works for, on some people. But to me, the, when I uh, that's always a red flag when you have the word survival in the front of something because it, you know, I'm not carrying this around with me everywhere I go, and I don't need this to survive. I don't need a bow. Um, I just wanted this bow because I think it's um, interesting, and it's, it looks fun, just something different. Um, and it's uncomplicated. It's very simple. So anyway, that's my rant for tonight. Um, I hope someone finds this useful. As always, please like, subscribe, and share. Make sure you follow the Facebook group and Instagram. There'll be more information on those. Um, yeah, thanks for watching, and uh, I hope you found this useful. We'll see you next time.